Hi, welcome. For those of you new here, my name is Katie. I'm a wife, I'm a mom, and I work full-time. I love makeup and skincare, and I truly believe every single woman wants to look and feel her best, and I have the tools and the resources to help you get there. And today, I thought you would want to see a behind-the-scenes of me organizing my makeup studio. So, every couple of months or so, I typically try to just go through my makeup studio, get rid of things that are expired or I don't use anymore, um, donate things, and just generally clean up the space. Now, I may do it a little bit more frequent during the holidays because I'm getting some additional product with the Unique Black Friday deals and just other products that are on special. So what I'm doing right now is I have this three-drawer um, organizer and I'm just going through and getting all of the stuff that's in those drawers organized. I normally have some baby wipes and some different makeup bags that I use for traveling and so I'm just trying to go through that drawer and get everything organized and then this drawer here is where I keep my tweezers and my scissors and my headbands and all that so I just kind of look through and say okay is everything in good shape? Is everything organized? Because sometimes I will just be in a rush to get things put away and I'll just throw it in the appropriate drawer, but I won't actually like put it away the way that it is supposed to be. So here you can see I'm going through the other drawer now. This is where I keep all of my palettes as well as my towels that I use during my lives. So I like to keep three or four in that drawer just because I'll use one for a couple days and then I will throw that towel in the wash and then I'll move on to the next one. And so um, at the same time that I'm going through and organizing the drawers, I'm also cleaning up my makeup studio desk shelf where I just throw all my makeup during my lives on the counter. And so I'm actually going through and cleaning things and putting things away. So this bottom drawer here, this is where I keep all of my backup unique supplies, products that I reach for all the time. And as soon as I use and I open up a new bottle of something, I will order another one. And so then I put it in this drawer. So that way I always have that product that is my go-to product on hand in stock all of the time but I also like recently I'd thrown some papers in there so now I'm just going through and sifting through those papers to say okay what do I need what can I throw up throw out not throw up throw out uh, and just get all of that bottom drawer organized and then for the most part the next top uh, how many drawers are there there's three or four above that bottom drawer for the most part, those drawers are pretty organized. So inside each one of the drawers, I have these little organizer dividers. And so I typically what we'll do is for a single set of product. So for example, all my blush goes in one of these little dividers. All of my bronzer goes in another divider. But again, sometimes when I'm in a hurry, I'm just randomly throwing things in drawers. And so this is my opportunity to just really go through, make sure that everything is in its appropriate spot and that everything is somewhat organized nicely. Um, here, I'm just checking my compacts. Sometimes I put compacts in the drawer that are pretty much done that need to be thrown out. So I just went through and double checked some of them. I'm checking all my eyeshadows in that top drawer. And now what I'm doing is, again, as I said before, Anytime I get to the end of something, I go online, I order a new one. And so sometimes I'll just stick that new product on the shelf. In this case, I need it to restock my biocellulose mask. I actually have a little organizer that sits on top of my desk that I use to keep my mask and my collagen on hand. And I love that because it's that visible reminder to use those products either on a daily or a weekly basis but then it's also really easy for me to glance at it and say okay what do I need to restock so in this case I noticed I was running low on collagen which I had just reorganized in that bottom drawer so I reached down here grabbed the box of collagen ripped it open and now I can replenish it and so now I can see exactly how much collagen I have at all times 
Uh, the other thing that I did is I brought in a Tupperware container. So you can see it at the bottom of the screen there. I have some unboxing videos that I want to do. And right now, all of that product is just like stacked up on the corner of one of my drawers. So I want to go through and organize this. Right now, I'm organizing my Lazy Susan. Again, just making sure that like products are together and that um, if something is supposed to be put away somewhere else, I put that product somewhere else. I'm checking stuff to make sure, okay, is this still good? How does it smell? I'm organizing my lip products. So I recently, I did a video recently where I reorganized all of my lip products and I got a new lip shelf to organize all those lip products, but it's really better for products that can stand on its own. So I went and I grabbed my old lipstick holder and now the lip products that don't stand very well on it, their own, I'm put in this other little lipstick holder and I'm kind of setting that off to the side. So here I am, I'm cleaning up those boxes. As I mentioned, I'm also going through, this is more of the products that I use on the regular. So I'm now that I've cleaned out and organized that bottom drawer, I'm sticking those products in that drawer. So that way that is all set and ready for me to go. The next time I need to grab my rose water or my cleansing balm, I know exactly where it is. So um, yeah, that is pretty much it for organizing the makeup studio. Like I said, I normally try to go through and really do a good clean out every two or three months. I just cleaned it out not too long ago. And so in this case, this was just a pretty quick run through to just mainly get everything new put away and make sure that my existing makeup is organized. So if you have any questions about my system, please don't hesitate to ask. If you like these types of videos where I share with you behind the scenes, you know, me doing something in the studio, please make sure to give me a thumbs up. Let me know that's in, let me know that in the comments. Be sure to like, subscribe, ring the bell so that way anytime I post a new video, you are notified. And again, I really appreciate you watching. Have a great day.